chapter 2 exercise 2.2 sum 3 we are going to see now third sum find the hcf of 252525 and 363636 so using any method if if they ask like that using euclid's division algorithm then you have to use only euclid's division algorithm but here in exercise 2.2 this exercise is about fundamental theorem of arithmetic okay how you do in smaller classes how to find hcf okay you will use a division method radial division method and find hcf that method you have to find it and you express as in powers okay then you can find the hcf that is what fundamental theorem of arithmetic using prime factorization we have to use l division method and write the factors in uh, prime factors in powers then we can find the hcf okay so first to find uh, we have to find the prime factors of first number okay so i am taking 2 5 2 5 2 5 l division method i am going to do so uh, first uh, prime number only you should take so it ends in 5 so 5 is a prime number you can take 5 first so 5 5 is our 5 5 is our 25 next also you are going to take 2 numbers so you have to put on 0 5 5 is our 25 again also you are going to take 2 digits uh, at a time so 0 next 5 ok next this number also ends with what 5 so again 5 5 ones are 5 Again, 0, 5s are 0, 5, 1s are 5, 0, 5s are 0, 5, 1s are 5. Now, you got this number, but you can check it. Use 2, we cannot uh, put it here, but 3 you can check. One, the, what is the divisibility rule of uh, 3? You can check the sum of the digits, right? 1 plus 1 plus 2, 3. 3 is divisible by 3. So, you can go for 3 here. So, 3, 3s are 9. Reminder 1, so it becomes 11. Again, 3, 3 is R. 9, remind the 2. So, 20, it becomes 20 now. So, 6, 3 is R, 18. Remind the 2, 21, okay. Here, yeah, 21, it becomes 21, okay. So, 7, 3 is R, 21. Again, you have to go which table. You have to check whether it is divisible by 3. 3 plus 3, 6. 6 plus 6, 12. 12 plus 7, 19. So, 3 is not possible. Next step. You can check with 5 is also not possible. 6 definitely not. So, 7 you can check with it. 7. 7 4s are 28. So, how much is remaining? 5 is remaining. So, 5 uh, five and 6 becomes 56. So, 8 7s are 56. 7 1s are 7. Next, you can check. This is also not divisible by 3. Uh, 7 also uh, if possible. 7 7s seven are 47. 6 are 42. Reminder. 6, no, 61 is not possible in a 7 table. So, 9 is not a prime number. 10 is not a prime number. So, 11, 11, uh, ones, 11 4s are 44. Remainder 41 is coming. So, check with 13 table. 13 3s are 13 3s are 39. Uh, 91 is 13 7s are 70. Uh, 13 3s are 39. Remainder 9. 13 7s are 91. So, we can 31 is a 37 is a prime number. You can stop it. Okay. So, 37 ones are 37. You can stop it. So, how will you write it? You can write 2. How will you express? 2 phi 2 phi as prime factors in powers is equal to 5. How many 5s are coming? 5 into 5. So, 5 square. Okay. Into 5 to the power 2. Next, 3 is only 1, 3. Next, 7 is also 1. So, power 1. So, 13 power 1 into 37 power 1. Okay. Next, we are going to find LC, uh, this one prime factors using L division method. This number. So, 3, 6, 3, 6, 3, 6. So, we can go with 2 table also, 3 table also. I am going with 3 table first. So, 1, 3 is 3, 2, 3 is our 6. 1, 1, 3 is 3, 2, 3 is our 6. 1, 3 is 3, 2, 3 is our 6. Again also 3 table. So, here... 3 4s are 12 together we are taking so 0 you should put uh, 3 4s are 12 again also 0 so uh, 3 4s are 12 next next you can go with yeah 2 2 2s are 4 0 2 2s are 4 0 2 2s are 4 next 2 2 1s are 2 
zero two ones are two zero two ones are two next next you can add the number of digits so it is three so you can go with three table three threes are nine reminder one again three threes are nine reminder two so six threes are eighteen reminder two so seven threes are ninety one so seven threes are sorry twenty one here right reminder three six threes are eighteen reminder two so seven threes are twenty one Next again, you can uh, you can see this number you have seen here also, so you can put it. So seven, four eighty one. Next thirteen table thirty seven. Next thirty seven ones are thirty seven. Okay. Now how will you write? Three six three six three six can be written as how many three how many twos we can? If we have twos also here we don't have twos right. So here, how many twos? One, two, two twos, right? So two power two into how many threes? Three threes, right? So three power three into how many seven? Seven to the power one into thirteen to the power one into thirty-seven to the power one. So now to find the HCF, HCF of what number? Two two five two five two five comma three six three six three six. How will you find the HCF? Only the common ones, okay? Common numbers alone you should take. So here the powers we expressed, right? So which is the lowest power? That will be the common, right? So five, five is not at all here. So no common. So we can leave five. Three is there. So three to the power one here. Here three to the power three here. But which is common? Only three. Only one three is common, right? So you have to write only one three first. Three to the power one into next seven to the power one. Seven to the power one is there. So seven to the power one into Thirteen to the power one, thirteen to the power one. Here also there, right? So one time you can write. Next is thirty-seven to the power one. Here thirty-seven to the power one. So this you have to thirty-seven power one. Thirty-seven power one. You have to multiply and find out. You can easily find what is thirty-seven into thirteen. You can find out thirty-seven into thirteen is what? Four eighty-one. Four eighty-one. So three into seven into four eighty-one. Four eighty-one into seven. This number. So three into Three 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 seven. So three 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 seven into three is what? One zero one zero one. So for the HCF of these two numbers using fundamental theorem of arithmetic is what? One zero one zero one. This is the answer.